was one of the first African American women multimillionaire. One of her quotes is Don't sit down and wait for the opportunities to come. Get up and make them, which is pretty inspiring. This is a picture of when she was a child, or it's Photoshop. I don't really know, but they look the same. So. She was the first to be born free out of her five siblings. She was an orphan at seven because her parents both died, and she moved with her older, older sister. She was married at 14 because she wanted to get away from her older sister's abuse, and she never went to school. This is a picture of her adulthood. She made a $1.50 a day with a child and only washed her hair once a month. She started working for the real first African-American woman in multi-million. Annie Malone. Annie Malone was actually the first African-American woman millionaire, but she never got credit because she lost all her money in the Great Depression. She moved her business to Indiana because black businesses were booming there. And she actually made a college after her daughter, Aaliyah College. This is one of her slips that she made to uh, get business. Madam C.J. Walker made the heat home, and as I said before, she was one of the first African-American multimillionaire. Um, she made a hair roll that did not kill her hair grow, and another fact is that she um, um, built a house that was really, really big. It was like a mansion had like kept like a lot of rooms, and she held um, civil rights movement things there, and people still use it to this day. Another fun fact is that she, when she started her company and she hired all um, women, they made more than men in a week. This is more information. You can click the site if you want more.